I'd like to tell you a story about my love for hockey. No, not that hockey. This hockey. But first, I must confess, I don't play hockey, and I rarely watch hockey. I know very little about the game itself, and although I can skate, I can only skate marginally better than a child. No, I love hockey because of what it's meant to my daughter. I moved with my wife and three kids to Duluth, Minnesota from Boston in 2010 for a new job. All three of our kids are naturally introverts and took some time to warm up to our new city. For my five-year-old daughter, that happened through the local sport, hockey. She had discovered a hockey stick in our new backyard and asked what it was. I explained that it was for the sport called ice hockey, and right there, she decided she wanted to play. We laced her up and put her on the ice that winter with some hesitation, and then watched as she barreled through the other kids for the puck. All kids wobbled on the ice, she haltingly gathered up speed, pushing her way toward the puck and knocking over anything and anyone in her way. Whose kid was that? We didn't recognize her. When asked by other parents if our daughter came from a family of hockey players, we had to admit that no, she came from a family of teachers and accountants who knew nothing about hockey. Somehow this game of hockey had transformed her. She found a new confidence, a new identity on the ice. It was as if the uniform had made of her a superhero. We knew she didn't care for princesses, but we didn't expect her to become the Hulk. She played hard, fought hard, and found success. Our little girl, who could barely talk to her classmates, found friends among her teammates. Once her hockey coach and his daughter moved in next door, my daughter's fate was sealed. These two girls have gone on to continued success playing with the boys for four years. Where will all this lead? Who knows? All I can say is that hockey, yes hockey, has helped my daughter find her identity and make her friends. And for that, I love hockey.